As we continue to break down the 2022 Fordham Rams, we move to the defensive side of the ball with a look at the defensive line. The Rams return three of the four starters from 2021, led by senior captain Jonathan Coste, a preseason all Patriot League selection. Last year, Coste returned to action after suffering an injury in the spring season, appearing in three games. He made 11 total tackles, including five for a loss and one and a half sacks. Other returning starters to the defensive line include senior Alfonso Dixon, junior Richard Hofus, and sophomore Matt Jaworski. Dixon started all 11 games last year, recording 44 total tackles, including eight for a loss and five sacks. He led the team in tackles for loss and sacks. Hofus appeared in nine games, recording 33 total tackles, including one sack, while Jaworski appeared in 10 games as a freshman, recording 39 stops, including five and a half for loss and three and a half sacks. Other experienced players returning to the defensive line include grad student Anthony Diodato, who was limited to five games last year by injury, along with seniors Elijah Armstrong, who saw action in three games last fall, and John Turley, who appeared in one game in 2021. Also back are juniors Jason Walker, who appeared in all 11 games last year, making 12 tackles, and Amir Lyles, who saw action in two games last fall, along with sophomores Jack Lowe, who was limited to four games last season by injury, and Tristan Wright, who appeared in one game last year. The Rams also welcome a number of newcomers to the defensive line, including Claudie Robinson from nearby Don Bosco Prep in Ramsey, New Jersey, Sam Burkle, a product of St. Xavier High School in Cincinnati, Ohio, Colby Spencer, who played at Suffield Academy in Suffield, Connecticut last year, Michael Thorne, a graduate of West NASA High School in Callahan, Florida, Peter Chaloub, who played at St. Ignatius Prep in Cleveland, Ohio last year, and Ryan Zolnick from Santa Margarita Catholic High School in Mission Viejo, California. All right, Jonathan, uh, about a week and a half into camp now. How's it been going? Um, it's been going real good. We got a lot of uh, young guys who are, um, you know, like really taking the coaching, really uh, following the leadership. Um, it's very competitive out here. Um, but yeah, it's just the competition level is, is through the roof. So we're having a lot of fun with this camp for sure. Now, is this the deepest uh, the defensive line has been since you've been here? There seems to be a lot of <coughs> a lot of guys on the line. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Previous years we didn't have that much depth um, in the in the D-line room. Um, but a lot more breathers now, for sure. A lot more for rest breaks. <laughs> now, now, you personally, um, you missed probably the first half for six, seven games last year. You came back for the last couple of games. How does it feel to be back for a camp and be able to get back into playing shape at, you know, at this point? Oh, it feels great. Um, you know, it was real hard being out for the season, being away from my teammates. Um, the injury kind of, you know, taught me a lot, um, taught me how to take care of myself, uh, how to prepare better. Um, but yeah, it's just, this is my last camp and this is the most fun I've ever had. Uh, here on the field for sure. Now, last question: How sick are you getting? Uh, getting hitting the same guys every day? <laughs> <laughs> I get sick of it. I mean, I love doing it, but yeah, I'm real excited to do it against somebody in the opposite uniform for sure.